need to master the following four points of this meridian. One, body surface distribution of the full tying meridian. Two, the relations with downfall organs in the process of circulation. Three, the characteristics of this meridian. Four, the indications and outline of this meridian. The general circulation of meridians on the surface of the body, big toe or foot, medial lower limb, abdomen, chest. The spleen meridian is connected with some important organs, stomach, spleen, heart, esophagus, the root of the tongue. The characteristics of this meridian, it connects a lot of zhangfu organs, relatively speaking. The role and the clinical significance of this meridian. The spleen meridian of Fu Taiying starts from the tip of the big toe. It runs along the middle side of the dorsal ventral boundary of the big toe, ascend to the front of the medial malleolus and feathers up to the middle side of the lower leg. It follows the posterior side of the tibia and passes through the front of the liver meridian, going along the anterior medial side of the knee and thigh. It enters the abdomen, reaches the spleen, its pertaining organ, and connects with the stomach. Passing through the diaphragm and running along the esophagus, it reaches the tongue root and the spirit over the under the tongue. A branch goes upwards through the stomach and the diaphragm, follows into the hair and hand over the meridian qi to the heart meridian of Han Shaoying. The general circulation of meridians on the surface of the body, big toe of foot, medial lower line, abdomen, chest, the spleen meridian is connected with some important organs, stomach, spleen, heart, esophagus, the root of the tongue. The characteristics of this meridian, it contacts a lot of downfu organs, relatively speaking. The attending summary of Fu Taiying.
according to the circulation of the meridian and the visceral organs and parts that communicate with him. We should be able to derive summary of the main treatment of this meridian. The spleen meridian mainly treats spleen diseases, stomach diseases, gynecological diseases, external genitalia diseases, and other diseases in the meridian. The summary of the experience of Asian doctors is mainly related to diseases of the spleen and the stomach. The most obvious symptoms of the meridian disorder are follows. Stiffy tongues, vomiting after eating, stomach ache, abdominal distension, frequent irritation, be elevated after both movement or passing flat, heaviness of the whole body. As for the symptoms due to a disorder of the spleen, pain in the tongue root, acnesia, inaptance, vexation, acute pain in the upper abdomen, loose stool, diarrhea, jaundice, difficulty in sleep, sweating and the medial side of the thigh and the lower leg, cold extremities, Disability of the big toe. The spleen meridian mainly treats spleen diseases, stomach diseases, gynecological diseases, external genitalia diseases, and other diseases in this meridian. Make a summary of the meridians of the spleen meridian. The first point is that the general circulation of the meridian, big toe of foot, medial, lower line, abdomen, chest. The second point is that the visceral organs and the important parts it contacts, stomach, spleen, heart, esophagus, the root of the tongue. The characteristics of this meridian, it contacts a lot of Fu organs, relatively speaking. The last point is the main treatment summary according to the circulation of the meridian and the visceral organs and some important parts which it passes through. We can infer the outline of the main treatment. It is mainly the diseases of the spleen and stomach and other diseases passing through the meridian.